Uh, we met at the Roskilde Festival, yeah, 2004. Yeah, yeah, five years ago. We were, I played the same tent, I think, the night before, and I was coming back and just watched them play, and then we kind of just we just ran around and watched other bands and kind of like other bands do, I guess, at festivals. And then we just... He was the only other American yeah. we knew. <laughs> so. so we just kept up from there uh, and we see each other on tour. And I was with Gnarls and he was with Shins and we would just keep up with each other over the years. As things sort of started to wind down for me on, on Wincing, I, w I decided I wanted to try something just totally different. I, I needed to kind of change things up it had gotten to be like start to feel heavy you know and so I just wanted I didn't know what I wanted to do maybe a solo thing or start a new band or whatever and Brian happened to be having the same sort of ideas yeah I was kind of wanting to try something different too I didn't want to really produce other records anymore and I wasn't really wanting to tour so much more with the stuff I was doing with Gnarls we hadn't really started on another record yet, so I thought it would be great to just try something with James. I didn't know what it was going to be, but since we had a lot of time in front of us, we didn't tell anybody, and we just started working on it as a, as a band, really. It's great. I mean, that's the way I would always do it if, if, if in the future it's possible. Um, <laughs> it's not now, though. <laughs> no, unfortunately it's not, but it does help because, you know, you don't really have any expectations. You know, even though, even we don't have, we didn't really have any when it came to what it was supposed to sound like, kind of sound like, what people thought of it, because we didn't really even play stuff for people early on until much later on into the album. Brian didn't realize, but I was like, I was pretty nervous because I had never done anything like that. I'd always, you know, had my own studio and my own little fortress or whatever that I worked in, and it worked out, you know. I mean, within an hour of sitting down and messing around with uh, some weird, like, toy keyboard thing, we had a song on the way, you know? Our friends knew. I think yeah, our yeah, friends, my knew. friends they just, they just knew not to say anything. Yeah. That was all, you know? I was like, oh, I'm just working on this thing. And for me, it's easy because people are going, oh, yeah, you're working on something. You're always working on something. I'm like, yeah, 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 exactly. And there's nothing. It's no big deal. So <laughs> for about a year... Over that time, we kept it a pretty good secret. 